ExxonMobil is one of the largest and most profitable companies in the entire world. So getting a job there is always going to be competitive. And the most important interview question you are going to be asked is why do you want to work at ExxonMobil? And if you don't have a great answer for this, they're probably going to hire somebody else who does. Because any position you interview for, you're going to be going up against a bunch of qualified individuals who are also really impressive. Today's video, I'm going to give you three amazing answers to this question so you can stand out as the best and most hireable candidate. Again, this is episode three in a five episode series on how to get a job at ExxonMobil. So this is the first video that you're seeing. Make sure you go back and watch the first two and we have two more coming up. I will actually use at the very end of this video, I'll have a link leading into the next one so you can move on to that next one after you finish this video. All right. Let's get into it. Now, the first thing you need to do is you need to have a good technique. The good technique to use to answer why do you want to work here uh, for any company is the 50-50 rule. Now, the 50-50 rule states that the first 50% of your answer needs to be about why the company is attractive to you. It could be anything about them. It could be their technology, their culture, whatever it is. Pick something about the company in the second 50%. Well, that needs to be about why you are a great fit for the role you are interviewing for why this is the perfect time in your career, why you have the great experience, why you're passionate about it. And if you can couple these two things, 50% about the company, 50% why the role is a great fit for you, you're gonna nail it. Now the first answer that we're gonna go over is the guiding principles answer. So instead of um, culture or a values page, they have guiding principles. And these are guiding principles that help dictate the way they approach business, the way they approach their communities, the way they approach employees, customers, etc. We're specifically going to talk about community because ExxonMobil has actually pumped a ton into the community and various different things. So I'm going to bring a little bit of information up here. You can find this on their website. So the way you might start this, uh, this answer is after this, uh, you know, why would you want to work at ExxonMobil? You'll say, well, there's actually a few reasons why I'm very interested in working for ExxonMobil. But one of the things that is really exciting to me is when I was doing my research for this interview, I went on your website and I read about your guiding principles. Specifically, I read about the community uh, aspect of that and how much ExxonMobil gives back to the community, different organizations, fighting diseases like malaria, and I found that to be incredibly inspiring. In addition to that, in my career thus far, I've done a lot of what's in the job descriptions must-haves, and I've excelled at these responsibilities and the things that motivate me to turn in my best work on a day-to-day -day basis. So that's why I feel like this would be a great job for me, and it's why I want to work for ExxonMobil. Now, that's a great way to answer it. You, you briefly talk about why the company is great, and then you highlight you're a good fit. Now, in there, I, I included the bit about malaria. So... I'm going to put a little chart here. I'm going to put the bit on malaria here, but there are a lot of different things you can pull from in terms of the way they contribute to the overall well-being of the communities they serve, the way they sew back into their environment. There are many different things. So what I would recommend doing is going to their website, going to their guiding principles, reading about what they do from a community involvement standpoint, find something that specifically resonates with you and use that as the baseline for your why. Now, again, I think they're, um, you know, giving $120 million to uh, curing malaria is amazing. I think some of the other community involvement things they do are amazing. So just pick something that is meaningful to you. Okay, now the next reason you're going to give that you're motivated to work for ExxonMobil is their energy efficiency um, efforts. Now, ExxonMobil is really intentional about what they do in terms of trying to be energy efficient. I read on their website, and I'll plop it here, that they um, are able to avoid six metric tons of gas emissions um, through a process called cogeneration. Now, I'd recommend going to their website and reading about it because I am not an engineer, um, and I won't give you the best explanation, but essentially it's uh, using byproducts of energy generation to generate more energy. But I would definitely like Google it, read it on their website, and don't just you know say what I'm saying. Um, however, this is a great reason to be interested in the company. So this is particularly good if you're an engineer and maybe you'd be involved in this place. But if they ask you the question, why do you want to work for ExxonMobil? It might sound something like this. Well, that's a great question. And there's a few reasons why I'd be interested in working for ExxonMobil. But one of the things that is particularly inspiring to me um, is the way ExxonMobil uh, is trying to be good stewards of the environment. So I was doing my research for this interview and I was reading about your cogeneration efforts and the way you're able to avoid um, you know, um, polluting the environment, clean that up a bit. Um, and I found that to be really inspiring. That's something that I've been able to do as an engineer in my career. It's something that I'm really passionate about contributing to. So working for a company where there are efforts like that and success, 
is awesome and would be really inspiring to me. Additionally, I feel like I'm really well qualified for this role. When I look at the responsibilities and the must-haves and the nice-haves, I check all the boxes and it's what really motivates me to be um, a great contributing member of a team. So I would be really excited about a role like this. And that's why I wanna work for ExxonMobil. So there, um, again, you wanna make sure you're delivering a clean version of why um, their energy efficiency is inspiring to you. But again, couple, you know, energy efficiency, call out what you're interested in calling out with why you're a good fit for the role and you'll nail it. Now the next answer is the digital technology answer. And if you're in IT in any way, shape or form, or just this is something you're interested in, this is a great way to demonstrate that you've done research um, and to, to give a, a great reason why you'd be interested. Specifically, um, if you go to their website and you read about their technology, they're going to have a breakout on what they do um, from a digital technology perspective. Specifically, they highlight their work in the Internet of Things. Um, and if I was going into IT, if I was going into some sort of system or network role, this is a great way to answer this question. And you'd say, well, there are a few reasons why I'm really interested in pursuing this job with ExxonMobil, but I was reading up on your digital technology and what you're doing with the Internet of Things, and that's right up my alley. That is a area of passion for me. I have experience in doing that, and I'd love to take the next step of my career where I could be more involved in that technology. Now, specifically, this role, I feel, is a really good fit for me because, and then you would go on to list why you're a good fit for the role. But either one of these three answers is going to really make you stand out as a great candidate. Another thing that's gonna make you stand out as a great candidate is asking really good questions in the interview. It's a key element to differentiating yourself you know, from the other candidates, which is why I made this video. This video here is going to give you five great questions to ask during your interview that's going to make you stand out as an amazing candidate and increase the likelihood that you get the job. So I am done here, but I will see you over there.